Hi sisters, James Charles here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you guys know anything about me, you would know that right now, one of my biggest addictions and guilty pleasures is TikTok. I've talked about it on social media, I've talked about it in interviews. I love TikTok, I'm obsessed with it, it's so fun. And I made a few different YouTube videos about it. Ooh, yes! And the reason I love it so much is because I truly feel like it's a place where everyone can go and express themselves and everyone has an equal opportunity to go viral. There's of course a dancing content, there's good dancing content. <laughs> And then there's my dancing content. There's a lot of makeup, there's funny jokes and stuff. Don't be shy. Get some more. <laughs> Point being, it's super, super entertaining and I'm literally obsessed. Don't be shy. Get some more. <laughs> Ever since I joined the app a few months ago, I've made a quite the splash. Not like a Charlie D'Amelio type splash. Okay, I'm not saying that. My presence on the app has definitely been met with a lot of positivity and also a lot of not so positivity about my lack of dancing skills. When you glue your fingers together, his hands be like hands emoji. But regardless, one of the coolest features about TikTok is this thing that they have called Do where basically anybody can make a video response to your actual post. Now, sometimes people add things to them, sometimes people make funny jokes out of them, or sometimes people are just plain old me. So for today's video, I thought it'd be really cool to react to the reactions and see what people are saying about me on TikTok. Let's get started. Also, I should probably say before we start this, I have not gotten the pleasure or maybe displeasure <laughs> of watching some of these yet. Lewis actually found all of them and will not let me see them until right now. So let's go. Okay, sisters, I was literally just informed of some very serious tea right now, which I am going to spill for you. This is James Charles. Well, let's go yes. back about 300, 400 years. We have this guy right here, which is James Charles, the king. Well, James Charles always said, I rule the land. I am the best. I do everything awesomely. I, well, I, I, that's very interesting because if we go back to I, James, Charles right now we spell out his first name which is James that is exactly five letters well if we spell out his last name which is Charles <laughs> that is exactly seven Son letters which is interesting because what comes in between five and seven six <laughs> which famous device has exactly six letters in it the iPhone and how's it spelled I Phone. Very interesting because who created the iPhone? Steve Jobs, supposedly. But the king of the internet, what is the king of the land, and in all reality, we don't know much about Steve Jobs because yes, Steve Jobs didn't create the iPhone. James Charles <sighs> did. <gasps> oh. I'm literally sister shook right now. James Charles, you don't have to hide it anymore. We all know. <laughs> what? Oh my god, literally what? Also, does he have swatches all over his arm? Look at that, or is that a tattoo? Wait a second, there was a king named James Charles in like the ancient days? I don't think there was ever a J there was a Charles I who was the king of England and the king of Scotland and the king of Ireland. Damn, he really got around. Well, yeah, I think I, I did invent the iPhone. It's time to come clean, you guys. Beauty is just a fun little side job for me. So this is really the project. Actually, this is a, that's a total lie, okay? You know how I'm gonna tell you that I'm not, in fact, Steve Jobs, the inventor of the iPhone? Because this camera sucks and it keeps getting worse every single year that the iPhones come out. I would never do that to y'all, okay? My selfies are suffering, your selfies are suffering. Every time that I answer a FaceTime call in the car or in sunlight, I'm literally white cast with the family goes I don't understand why Apple okay this TikTok is by Kendall raindrop people only like you because you James Charles I'm assuming that's your James Charles people don't like you because of your underboob people don't like you because you look like Kendall Jenner people don't like you because of your legs I think that's you I think that's me She looks like me. Wait, like, give me, where's the pink wig? Can I see your hat? <laughs> Am I Kendall Raindrop? Oh my god, I found my doppelganger. Oh shit, this is gonna make me look so bad now. I look like I was in the raindrops and got electrocuted. This post is from a user named Slimmy Slim 941 Okay, I'm already scared. It's the, it's the me as a woman with a back throw on. You down for a date this week? I got one of Sophie's friends. Oh no, that wants to hang out with you. <laughs> oh no! Wait, it says to Adam Sela. Damn, she's beautiful. What day? I think you're gonna like this girl. She's an Arab. Does she look familiar? Not having met her though. She's gorgeous. Oh. 
And he sends my tweet, of course. Wait, what? WTF? Wait, that's James Charles. Wow. She cute though. But damn. Okay, I mean, to be honest, I did look cute though. Does James Charles have a sister though? I mean, it's me though. Hello, I am the sister. Okay, this TikTok is by Avim2021. And oh, again? Okay, this also starts with the picture of me and the wig. This is to dad. Oh no. Rate her one to 10. Solid 13 out of 10. That's right. Oh my God. Who is she? That is Charlie D'Amelio from TikTok. That is not Charlie D'Amelio from TikTok. Actually, that is James Charles. Yes, that it is James Charles. A lot of people, for some reason, say that I look like Charlie D'Amelio, and I honestly don't see it. Maybe the wig on, but like, I definitely need to glam Charlie so I can see what she looks like with like a full James Charles beatdown, because then maybe we would look similar. If you guys want to see that video, let me know and let her know as well. But thanks, Dad, for rating me 13 out of 10. It means the world. Oh my god, I need to <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh no. That is what I would look like as a Visco girl, I guess. They could have chosen a better photo of my face, first of all. This girl's body looks sickening. Okay, I wish that my body looked like this, minus the boobs, of course. The high waisted pants, sickening. Puka shell necklace, wouldn't catch me dead in that. And then, of course, we got the messy bun. As you all know, I had a bun at one point. <laughs> It was the worst decision of my entire life. And then I cut it off, which was the best decision of my entire life. So this is slightly triggering. I loved the song though. We see you from the night sky. I love how we just used the live version. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Come on, put some more. Don't be shy, put some more. Put some more. Oh, this is my, it's just John. Yeah, I know him. He's the one who asked me to prom on TikTok. <laughs> put some more. Oh my God. Yeah, put some more, don't be shy. <laughs> put some more. Okay, fun fact for you. This TikTok of me saying the put some more one was actually posted by my friend Drew on his account. There was a really popular video that went viral during Halloween time of some girl that did it. Come on, don't be shy, put some more. If you take your iPhone camera, which I did not invent, and you put it on the 0.5 thing, like you click like and move it this way, and you film somebody's head at like this angle, don't be shy, put some more. Yeah, put some more, don't be shy, put some more. Really? Don't be shy. I put some more. Yeah, yeah, it looks some really more. scary. Oh, it's not even that bad. Well, I mean, it's scary, but it could be worse. Come on, put some more. So that's how that was created. Um, I don't have anybody held hostage. Don't be shy. In my house, just to clear the air um, and rid myself of any more false allegations because we don't need any of those. So LAPD, if you're watching, not invited over. Leave me alone, please. <laughs> that was actually, those were funny. Okay, this TikTok is by Seth O'Brien. That name sounds really familiar for some reason. Okay. I just got a text from my friend and he was not having a Jay Charles video! Yeah, so this first TikTok is from Seth O'Brien. I, I yes! Oh my god, I knew okay, I knew it. This is a little bit of a drive. Seth is like, giving the girls a run for their money. I think I just sister shitted my pants. <laughs> Oh, I knew that name sounded familiar. If you guys have not seen my reacting and recreating to viral TikToks a few months ago, I reacted to Seth's original TikTok in that video. That's so cute that he actually saw it and then reacted to it on a TikTok. I didn't even see this. Oh my God, Seth, you were literally so cute. And if I ever get to meet you, let's definitely do a TikTok in person. Okay, we would look so fabulous and glam together. I'm so glad that you liked my first video and ah, and I am really grateful for your support. This one is by Caitlin105 and the thumbnail is uh my senior your yearbook. Put some more. <laughs> this Come on, put some more again. Ah! Oh no! More. Oh no, absolutely not. Oh, absolutely not. Put some more. <laughs> Come on, put some more. Don't be shy, put some more. Oh no. Not a double space one with orange glitter in the roots for spirit day. Probably my worst hair day ever. Also me with this H&M red and blue top on, I thought I was like, this was like the epitome of fashion to me. I had glasses, braces, and this hair. If we're gonna watch this one, we're at least gonna get something positive out of it. Okay, let's take a moment to appreciate how gorgeous I look in my senior yearbook photo. And my senior quote was, use code James for 10% off. Oh God, I wish I didn't have to see that one. This one is by Robert. Tolpe, and I have seen some of his TikToks before. He makes crazy, insane animations. I'm scared for this. It's been a long time since it came around. Oh my god. It's been a long time back in town. What, Robert, if you're watching this, what goes through your head to make these TikToks? This is Dr. Phil as a shirtless 
mermaid and myself obviously playing my sister's piano banging on the keys with my six inch long red acrylics uh singing lady gaga's you and i dr phil's just fully swimming around all over me i also love that i'm like my head is i'm like it's been a long time it's been did you like that live reenactment? Now I just need, we should do a collab with Dr. Phil and reenact that live in person. We should have our people call his people. This is by Jeremiah Taylor. First of all, before I even hit play, this makeup looks sickening. Oh my God, the skin, beautiful. The brows, stunning, gorgeous, structured. The white paint, so even, so good. Oh, love this already. Okay, let's go. I'm going to be flat for the, I ha, oh no. This is not good. Okay, this is an audio from my YouTube video. What video is this from? Do you remember? If anybody in the comments watching this recognizes that and knows the video that's from, please leave me a comment down below. I love that. I guarantee some of you guys will know my own videos better than me. That is so funny. Jeremiah, you killed this makeup look. You look so cute. I love this. This next one is by Be Fast Official, and this is a duet to one of my TikToks. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh my God, he's literally thin again. Even the stuffed animal in Finn's mouth. That is so funny, are you kidding me? <laughs> okay, that one definitely gets a thumbs up in my book. Thank you, BFAS Official, for that work of art, truly. This TikTok is by Oatmeals2, and it is just a man, and he is doing a duet to my TikTok that I posted recently of the Mingo Girl going crazy on the beach. Damn, her ass fat. Oh. <gasps> That just makes it better, to be honest with you, man. <laughs> Let's get it, boy. <laughs> oh! Yummy James Charles. Wait, what the heck? That was so unexpected and so nice. You love a man who is confident enough to compliment somebody when he thinks they're cute, okay? All right, this one is by Blind Shark, and it, this is horrifying. Is this a Chucky doll? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> It's gone. Okay. <laughs> oh my God. That audio is from the uh, Flashback Mary video for sure. You guys know I love horror movies. Somebody please make and then cast me in a James Charles horror movie or uh, honestly any horror movie period. But Flashback Mary, she needs her cinematic debut. Don't you think? Like there's definitely a storyline there for sure. Hi sisters. <laughs> this TikTok is by Paige Sinova and it is just a picture of me from one of my photo shoots. You said that you could let it go and I wouldn't catch you hung up on somebody that you used to know. But you didn't have to cut me off. Oh, oh my God. That is hands down the best usage for that song ever. Oh my God. That was not where I expected that TikTok to go. Speaking on this topic also, especially in recent TikToks where I have worn biker shorts, there is a rumor and that is that I no longer have my, um, my, uh, 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 Sister Schlong. Um, I am here to set the record straight. It is in fact still there, but I wear biker shorts and sometimes tight fitting clothing. So therefore it goes tucked underneath. This is so uncomfortable to talk about. I want to be done. <laughs> that was a good quality tech talk though. Holy shit. But you didn't have to cut me off. My poor pee pee. Okay, well, after that video, I think that is definitely time to call it quits. That is enough TikToks for today. Holy crap, I had so much fun watching and reacting to these. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up down below and also leave me a comment. Let me know which video was your favorite. And if you guys are ever scrolling on your For You page and you see something funny about me or just in general, honestly, please tag me or tweet me. I love, love, love to see them. If you have not ready, make sure to click that bigger subscribe button down below and come join this sisterhood. We're almost to 17 million sisters which is insane and I would love to have you join the family and also click that bell icon so you get a notification every time I upload a brand new video. If you'd like to follow me on my makeup journey you can follow me on Instagram or Twitter, TikTok and Facebook are all just James Charles. My Snapchat for more behind the scenes sites up is James Charles the next S after Charles and if you guys want to send me a text and get instant updates about my new YouTube videos, merch, new photos and literally everything under the sun make sure to send me a text at 310-905-8746 and yes 
It is really me. This video is sister shout out goes to sister Maya. Thank you so much love for always following and supporting. I love you so, so, so much. And if you like to be in the next videos, sister shout out, don't forget to always retweet my video links when you go live on Twitter and also turn on my YouTube post notifications. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I love you and I will see you in the next one. Bye.